Okay, what I'm gonna do here today right quick, and normally I don't like to go in my boxes much in July. And, uh, but this one here, these bees in this long box, they're having to work a little extra hard just to keep the heat out because my poor design on the top, what I did, I don't have any inner covers on here and it's just a lid sitting on top. There's two things happening. They don't have their bee space up there so they, they're actually drawing cone, gluing the top down and it can't breathe well enough um, to get the heat out. So they're having to force heat down in the screen bottom. They're louder than any other bee box out here in the yard in the late, late in the evening. So what I did, my second box here, another problem I had also that I didn't mention, they were hinged. Right here, let's see, thing too shaky. But uh, they were hinged and every time you close the lid, that's a piano hinge, you got bees down there that's getting squashed so I took that off to solve that problem and I made inner covers thick inner covers hopefully they won't warp and I put a shim let me get my hands out of the way I put an extra shim here for when it's down let's get on this angle you can see I have a bee space now. And also, I have given them ventilation here. And I also have shimmed each one of these pieces where the air, this is screened, I didn't show you that. That's, that's screened where the other critters can't get in. Anyway, when the top's laying on there, it can vent out in all directions. And hopefully that'll fix the issue. But first what I have to do, I've got another regular hive body here. We have bees to probably right here, and it gets pretty heavy. The box itself's heavy enough. So I'm gonna take them out, put what I can, in this hive body here you have to just excuse the moving around set them out in here then move the box set this box back where that one is and move them back in I'm gonna try to do it quickly because like I said July I don't like messing with my bee boxes you create robin and everything else so, anyway, let's get started. Okay, here we go. Smoker fucked up a little bit again. <clears throat> So going to do a smoking right here. I don't want to get Robin started. July, Robin can happen fast. Otherwise, I wouldn't even smoke them. Anytime you see a brick laying like this, last time I looked, there was a mated queen. If you happen to see it like this, it's a queen cell. In there. That's just my way. Okay. You see how it's glued? When I designed it this way, 
my plan was to put a cloth uh, in the cover. And I got one, but the heat issue was already such a problem. I just felt the, cup, the cloth might even be worse. See my mess? And when I want to close it, these bees get hung up down in here. They're trapped when you go to close it. I don't know if you can see that from the camera. Can't come out. Board. Boy, they got that thing stuck down. Let's see what we got. I think this one's blank. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And put the heavy ones in the box. Mm -hmm. Things heavy. Big. Mm -hmm. kind of fast. <clears throat> you see what happens when you don't have the right bee space. I went ahead and made inner covers to start with before I screwed the thing, the lid down. Probably wouldn't have had this problem. But to me, it's kind of a work in progress, experimenting with it. The information you get on the internet is kind of mixed. Might find a queen on here. Nope. This is covered up.
it's already getting hot this morning. I'm sitting here mumbling. I said it's already getting hot this morning. It has to be. This was a medium frame I put in here. You can see that. This is where they made cone on the bottom. Ooh, there's still a lot of bees on the wall. Hopefully I can get them to crawl in. Lots is too big to pick up and slam. That's what I like to see. Building their own cone. Okay, I'm going to see if the queen had to be left in here. While I do that, I'm going to cover this up. A lot of bees still here. Hmm. make a move around a little bit see if she's in here I didn't really look real hard for her I'm hoping she's on one of those frames
I'm not seeing her, so I'm, I'm just set this box to the side. I can. Very carefully. It's still heavy enough, even without much in it. This is always my problem. Yeah, I'm always having to do this because my lid is hinged. And this is one of the biggest drawbacks. I may trap them. Maybe they'll move out of the way. I'm going to be off camera just a minute. 